Hey guys, if you want to see this great daytime look and you want to see me turn it into a really cute nighttime look, stay tuned. And I do want to let you know that my daughter will be in the background for most of the video acting crazy with her hair looking wild. So if you can bear that, please stay tuned and watch the video because the look is so pretty. So I hope you guys watch it. Comment after and let me know how you guys like it. Bye. Hey guys, okay, so first what we're going to do is we're going <clears> to <throat> place our concealer in all the places that we want to highlight and con um, contour. So I'm just going to go ahead and put it right here, right here, right here, right here, a little bit right here, right there, and right around here, your lips. And then, those are basically all the places that I feel um, need to, I guess, contour or highlight. Nothing really big or special. And then I'm just going to come back and we're going to go ahead and do the eyebrows. Okay, so you already know what I do with um, the eyebrows. I take my auto eyebrow pencil and I just go ahead and I draw in the areas that are sparse. I just like that. You can basically see the difference between the two. So then I'm going to take the other end, which is the brush, and I'm just going to brush out the front end of it, just for a nice fade in effect. So then I go ahead and I take my pencil that I use to define my brows, and my NYX HD concealer that I always use faithfully, and I go in and I just define my brow. Okay, so I've done both the eyebrows. I didn't go into basically how I did it because I have a previous video that you can watch on basically how you can define your brows. So next I'm going to go with this pencil right here. And it's basically a foundation brush. And I'm just going to go ahead and blend that color in that's under my eyes. And this is great for dark circles. Um, the NYX um, concealer that I have, it does a pretty good job of covering up any dark circles I have. So now that I've blended in the concealer under my eyes, what I'm going to do is I'm just going to take a regular eyeshadow brush. I'm going to take any brown from my um, 120 palette um, from BH Cosmetics. And I'm just going to tape off the excess or blow it off, whichever is best for you. And I'm just going to go ahead and I'm going to um, start contouring my nose. Okay, so now that I've blended some of the brown down, what I usually do is I just take my finger, nothing special. And just like that, and then take the brush. And just basically finish blending everything in. Okay, so now that I'm done, basically contour my nose. And after I used the eyeshadow brush and I went ahead and blended the brown as much as I could, I just took my fingers, of course, and I went in and I used the heat from my fingers to basically mesh everything together. And that's how it turned out. So now that I'm done that, I'm just going to take some more brown eyeshadow from my palette. And I'm going to go in and just contour my cheeks. I'm not going to do too much. Okay, so now that I basically did both sides, I um, contoured it and then I rubbed in that concealer down at the bottom to give it some nice dimension. I'm just going to go ahead and take my foundation, nothing special, and I'm going to go ahead and just basically um, um, put it all over my face. And the foundation, what it does is it basically pulls everything together. Now I just have this mascara and it's water resistant. I'm just going to go ahead and... Okay, so now that I put on my mascara and we're basically all done, I'm going to take my NYX pencil in Purple Rain and I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to line my lips up. Okay, so I just went in and I outlined my lips after I put on the lip cream and this is the finished look. Real pretty, real soft for daytime. Here's the lip. You see my fan on my bed because it is beyond hot here. It's 91 but it feels like hell. And it's Monday, so no pools are open, so we're just thugging it out with the fan. <laughs> and here's everything else. And stay tuned if you want to see me transform this into a nighttime look. 
Okay, so first what I'm going to do is I'm going to apply some lashes. And the lashes I have are Ice, which is Image Control Enhancers. And I love these because they have some normal lashes. But they also have some big, nice lashes that you see right here. And they're really adorable. I've already worn these maybe two times. So I'm going to go ahead and apply these. And then I'm going to be right back with you guys. Okay, so I'll put the lashes on and I've already did one eye. What we're going to do is we're going to take any um, eyeshadow brush that you have and we're going to take the darkest brown that you have and I'm going to use the brown from my 120 palette from BH Cosmetics and you can just go right here and basically what we're going to do is a really soft smoky eye, nothing serious. This is just a good color to transition from day to night and it's um, a good way to do this without you know basically taking off all your makeup and starting over you can just take any eyeliner you have i'm just going to use my nyx pencil and i'm just going to go right under okay so i'm just going to go ahead really quickly and line my lips with nyx's espresso and deep red and then i'm going to come right back to you guys okay so i lined my lips with the red and uh, filled them in and then i lined them with the brown so i'm going to go ahead and take my red lipstick <clears throat> and it's just a beauty supply store brand I'm gonna go ahead and just. Then I'm gonna go back in with the brown just a little bit to make it just a little bit darker because I like my red darker. I'm gonna show you how really quickly. And if I want a real dark, which I really do, I'll even take my black eyeliner pencil and I'll go and I'll just shade in on the sides and you'll see. Okay, so um, I added the lipstick and then I went in and I did kind of like the ombre effect. As I told you, with the black, I went in and basically shaded the sides. So the look is basically all done. The only thing, um, if you want to really amp it up, you can go ahead and add some blush. And I just have some NYX blush right here. Just go ahead and add that right here. And you don't have to put on a lot, just make it really subtle. And this is the blush that I use, just in case anyone is wondering. Standing on her bed. And if you want to just look real sun-kissed and bronzy, you can go ahead and just use this bronzer. Any bronzer, really, that you have. Right there. All right, to put it right. And that is about it. All the time. Real pretty. <clears throat> Let me just come closer so you can see the finished look. And I love the lips. These lashes are crazy long. I love them. But yes, that's the look that you can basically turn from day to night. So if you like the video, comment, subscribe. And I guess I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.